Welcome to the Brooklyn Bagel Blog. I'm the Bagel Borg, a finely tuned, highly calibrated bagel eating machine here to review every bagel in the universe. Today we're at Bagels on the Square in the West Village. This morning, this place is popping off. There are people coming in and out. Bagels on the Square is in a prime location and I'm very excited to review today's bagel. Now, before we get into the bagel itself, I have to comment. The efficiency of the ordering system in this place is phenomenal. You walk in, they've got a line out the door, and they zip you right on through. There's one guy, he takes your order, he takes care of you all the way through, sends you down. There's a guy there to ring you up, he does it, bing, bang, boom, bada, bing, bada, boom, you're in, you're out, you're done, you got your bagel, you're on your way to work. Also, take a look right here. They've got a nice little takeout window for those who are just looking for a little bit of coffee, don't need the full bagel order. I love to see all of the different options that you can get at Bagel on the Square to get in, get your bagel, and go to work. So, uh, of course we got the Everything Bagel with Scallion Cream Cheese, the litmus test. Now let's unwrap and see what we got under the cover to give the bagel itself a review. Okay. Steven, I like what I see here. Really nice distribution of the toppings up top. Um, very even cut. I can see this is a very solid bagel to cream cheese ratio. The bagel feels a little bit doughy in my hand. It doesn't, it doesn't have exactly the type of crunch that I would like um, in an ideal, a, a perfect, perfect five bagel. Uh, but I think this is gonna suffice. There are no double-sided toppings, which of course is going to have to deduct a couple of decimal points, as we all know. But, nonetheless, looks like there's a lot of scallions in here. Anytime you can get a, a bit more scallions into my cream cheese, the happier this Borg is going to be. So, nothing left to do now except take a bite and see what Bagels on the Square has to offer. I'm digging this. So, before we get to the final score, I want to spice it up a little bit and add a couple more categories. First off, it's a very onion heavy everything toppings. Me personally, I'm more a fan of a, of a salt. Go a little heavier on the salt and the sesame than the onion. The onion's a little bit overwhelming. The cream cheese um, is not as bold as I was expecting for the number of scallions it appears to have. So, relative to expectations, this is coming in a little bit lower than I would have expected. However, it's got a nice taste in my mouth, great feeling all together. And one more note, this is a very affordable bagel. You can get a dozen bagels plus a pound of cream cheese for no more than $16. That's a steal any day of the week. I might come here every day of the week. In any case, let's wrap all this up together and give this bagel a score. Let me calculate it quickly. All right, this is a 3.65131. Um, you know, I, I like the shop here. I like the way that they run things. I like the bagel itself, but it's got a couple of defects that just can't make up for the um, you know, the overall quality and impact the final score. If this were a little bit saltier, double-sided toppings, um, and a little bit crunchier on the outside, it would have a much higher score. But as it stands, 3.615131. I really hope I got that right the second time. Probably not, but in any case, boom, you're done. We'll see you next time.